Welcome back. Two years ago, Tommy Lee made one of the most dramatic entries into dancehall's mainstream when he was put to perform amongst the kingpins at the greatest reggae show on earth, Reggae Sunfest. Hey, Sunfest, anywhere we talk it, we'll be wanted to talk. Such was his appearance at the festival. The dancehall demon became easily one of the most talked about artists in the space. But one year later, all the hype surrounding Tommy Lee on the local scene appeared to have run out of steam. Some boys will link and feel that they link on the chain. And in more recent times, some of the only newsworthy items the artist has been associated with locally are an unfortunate motor vehicle accident that left him badly injured. Thank God they are alive. An arrest and charge for breaches under the Anti-Lottery Act and perhaps most shockingly to many, a recording in which the artist is allegedly crying out of frustration. Tommy Lee, who is now out on bail, joins us right here, right now, on our stage. Tommy Lee, blessed love, sir. So it's now um, dance all demon we call it, you know. Is yeah, that okay? Man. Yeah, man, no problem. Dance all demon. Okay. All right, I'm at the dance all demon. And so, are you fully recovered now from the accident? Yeah, man, kinda, you know. Kinda. About mm -hmm. Seventy-five percent, you know. Okay. So, so you're out on bail now, Tommy. Um, when is your next um, appearance in court? Um, in July. Mm -hmm. July. July. So, what can you tell us about the case? Well, I don't really want to talk about that now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. But um, you're lawyered up and we'll be making our second appearance or your first appearance since the bail. Yeah, man. Um, in in July. Samuels. July when? In July. I never should speak to this, isn't it? But I'm okay. in July and my lawyer burned some words, I govern mm -hmm. things. I don't know. It just was, it was just, it's just a little mistake, you know. Just at the wrong place at the wrong time, you know. But Jamaica, the whole world, no, I'm not up on them things, you know, scam thing, isn't it? Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's about all you can tell us about the case. We understand mm -hmm. because it's a case in court. All right, so let's go to the, the voice note. What can you tell us about the voice note that everybody's talking about in which you're crying out of frustration? What can you tell us about that? First Is it thing, you on it? On it? First thing first. Mm -hmm. Fiat Marina voice note, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Second thing, big old real boss. But real boss can't send nobody come page, doesn't it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Real boss knows so me evil, so they'll see it on the for bill, man, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So that didn't happen? Yeah, man, like that. Okay. All right, so it, that's what that is. So you're ignoring it. How are people responding to you? What are they saying to you? And is this how you answer when somebody asks you about it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what people are saying. Uh, just who around me, they don't ask me because they don't know nothing like that, is it? Okay. But it, it doesn't seem to affect your career. I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> no, so I don't know. But that can't yeah, affect my career, man. My real fans them know that so Tamale no played people, isn't it? Same. Uncle D, man, my thing there, isn't it? Yeah, man, fake voice note that. I don't know who come up with that idea. Maybe they should just voice note them girl or something, I record them girl. I don't know what they have to try to build up them thing against me. A lot of people sound like me and thing in there, isn't it? A lot of people talk like me. A lot of people sing like me and thing. People always try to study me and try to be like me and try to talk like me and anything. They say, I don't know. A lot of people will just build a little voice note and thing, isn't it? So, how hurt are you by it, even though you, you're saying it's... I tell them I'm hurt, you know, because it's like they might try to prejudice my case, isn't it? First, them say, them say, my arm, um, then say, the, the person say, me a scammer, you know them way? Okay. Yeah, and then them say more on runway go America, like them know I'm getting no a visa, you know them way they like them two things them see them do it hurt me, you know. Like them say oh like make a person talk like me say me, me is a scammer, you see me? Okay. And then them say 
more I run with America and them things. I mean, I don't like them argument and I advise not. Yes, but I'm, are you doing anything to, 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 um, to clear your name from it? Um, in, you know, in terms of, is there anything you can do that could prove that it's not you? You know, people just believe. Me don't have time to focus that, isn't it? That yes. past and gone a long time, isn't it? Yeah, man. I don't know my life. I don't go up on TV and reason with the people and make them know say, and me and thing, is it? Okay. All right. Let's talk about you. You're, you have an upcoming tour in Europe, right? Yeah, man. Now, before we go to Europe and your tour, let's talk about Cartel. Cartel's um, trial and conviction and so on. We have not heard anything from you since. What are your overall take on the whole thing and what yeah, happened to the world boss? Him done the, them done sentence him already, isn't it? So mm -hmm. when you want to go back to so just want me just wish he can get in appeal and bust it and come around so he can visit his family and govern things around, you know them way there. Okay. Yeah man. I just wish him my best and him just hurry up and get him appeal and do back road, isn't it? Okay, so you okay, so you you best you sending him greetings and good wishes. Yeah man. All right, so Europe is coming up. Some people may be surprised that you are booked to appear in Europe. And so on. Yeah, I get back my traveling documents and thing, and you know, and I do road, you know, and thing, but you don't know Europe. I go kick away Europe and thing and perform for the fans. Because last year I go and pass through the whole of Europe, England, you know, this year go be better, you know. So, uh, so the, the, you're in demand in Europe. So, all the time when we were saying that your fire kind of cool or, uh, and so on, offshore you were happening, Tommy Lee, because that's what I'm. That's, yeah, a, man, that's name, the vibe I'm getting from Heavy D. Remember, I said my name is Tommy Lee, you know, man, isn't it? Mm. I done boss already and my thing out there, you know. Remember, I said, you don't know me, you know, vibe, Vibes Cartel lying, you know. So, you know, say, you all really know me. Yes. Even more than enough of the artists, I will say, I kick up in my business a long time. Enough place, no more than with them, isn't it? Because mm -hmm. I reach enough place. I where them them not reach, isn't it? Okay. Mm -hmm. So last year, when we had some fest and so on, because you were just coming out of Europe, we saw some difference in you. You were now performed, your presence on stage at some fest was surprising to me personally. Um, because at the time you were kind of cool. A year before that, you were the man. Every man wants to see this Tommy Lee. At the gate, people say they were coming out for Tommy Lee. Moby was out in its in numbers for you. And then last year, your, your entry, your, your presence on the show was rather, rather cool. But what was surprising is your stage presence and your performance and your clarity. That's my take on that. Now, to what extent Europe impacted your performance ability, stage presence, and these things? I uh, see when you travel, like when you have a tour, it builds you, you know, it builds your vocal, it builds your performance, isn't it? Because you should have to go and have to perform often, isn't it? Yes. And you have to perform out the whole your tune, because it's different in a Jamaica. And in a Jamaica, you just freestyle and give them quick and fast, isn't it? But in a Europe, you have to sing. He sang from the start to the last, because sometimes the people don't want to hear the last line in the song or the last okay. instrument in the song, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So you have to sing out everything, so, you know? And you have to more commanding. Okay. Because the white people don't have to command them, you know, isn't it? European, you know. So you know? learned that while there, or did you know that before going and... and no, and, man, and, while and, there. And make, prepare accordingly. While there and come back. You see, like when you go, when you, you see, when you tour, mm -hmm. you see, when you come back home, it's like, when you perform, you come like a taking candy from a baby, you know. You get wicked, you're more commanding with the Jamaican people. You understand? Okay. You just, you come, it's like you got train and come back home, you know. You see me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you, how difficult was it for you to adapt to what the Europeans want? I, not really, you know, really. It's it, it like the first show, them and thing, me like be myself, then I me understand. I me start watch. I me go at a festival with Shaggy and a couple artists, and you see me? I me watch how them perform. Mm -hmm. And command the people them. So I just learn off of that, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I start learning off of command the people them and things, isn't it? Yeah, man. What, what else have you learned, Tommy Lee, as a ghetto youth from Jamaica on these tours, on, on, on going offshore from Jamaica and interacting, performing for people, interacting with, uh, with people uh, from other cultures, other races, in other places? Um, what have you learned, apart from uh, the, um, the well, performance learn, skills and so on? What yeah, else? I learned say, Jamaica is a nice place, you know? Mm -hmm. And we have a good weather and thing, isn't it? And we have some talented people. And I realized the dance hall 
dance hall in Europe big, you know, bigger than one of people think, you know. Mm -hmm. And dance hall music bigger than one of people think. Mm -hmm. And it, a lot of people, it, the dancers them, they have a lot of dancers, dance hall class and school, as I mean. Yes. Where my face in Jamaica more, you know, than where they cause the people them are trained for control dance hall, you understand? So my face if you watch dance hall and cherish it and make you sight, as I mean. And we had Bob Carr last week on, it, on the same show saying that he wish he could take out all the ghetto youth them out of Jamaica for a while to get to exposed to other places in the world, for just for a while, just to know how big the world is and how much there is to get from the world as a youth. Do you share those sentiments? Yeah, I can go experience it, but I know the day them go, when they go, and go love Jamaica more, you understand? Yes. Because Jamaica is a nice place, believe me, man. Everywhere hard life, they are struggling, you know? You see me? Not, not true in name America. A lot of people live there go through a lot of fears the same way and suffer and same way. Everybody suffer, you see me? Yes, but, but then it means that we should all work together to, to bring about, you know, um, a better state of affairs in Jamaica. Economic security and security in general. Where people Everything. can feel safe in Jamaica, just sure, like they man. do in, in Europe and in the US and so on. They feel safe and they have econo econ better, better economic security. Those are important reasons why things that we all can work together to achieve for our own little island called Jamaica. So let's talk now about your tour. Where is it going this year? In Europe, uh -huh. England, isn't it? Okay. And maybe Africa, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, man. All right. So that, so, okay, sounds, sounds good, Tommy Lee. What are you taking with you to them this time? Because you can, I'm, I'm sure you're going with new stuff yeah, that man, you, didn't, with you didn't give them last year. Yeah, man, I, drop, I just can't see me I do some work and think. From what the end, I'm a crash and thing, and I can't move. So I just decide, say, oh, let's go on easy, yeah, man, and just go and build out a hype and thing. And, you see me? Mm -hmm. Go and focus me on my album and spend some time with my family. Because when you know I say family, you know, family is a believer or Russell their own family. You see me? Mm -hmm. And I go and make my album the same way. I do some serious work on my album, you see me? And I kind of come up, as you can see, because enough interview me turn on and them things, you see me? Okay. But just me and rest my brain and go and focus some mm -hmm. little things on me. Because since I crash a lot of things, you know, I go on. I go home back, I go home, I'm going to get on my day after and I see a lot of things, you know, what need to fix, you know, them way they were. Okay. I never pay attention, you know. It's like I crash for a reason, you know, them way they. Mm. Like, if you man think, I'm not really, I mean, in Tamil, I can create, I can do a lot of things. I know if I go back on top easy, you know, them way they. Mm -hmm. As you can see now, I'm ready back for your road. Because you can see, I start doing my interview and thing, and I'm ready back for your road, and I'm straight, I start voice up, be a thing, and I have a lot of true, I have about 50 trucks for drop. When I drop it, you see me? So right. I just store them up and thing and okay. we're ready you know, for them to kick out their teeth. Listen, you know, uh -huh. I may not be young, you know, but I have a body sting. You see me, uncle? Lyrically, musically. You're yeah, talking. man. Mad. All right, bring us to an, an incident in Dominica. What can you tell us about that incident where you were turned back? You were you were actually arrested Why? in Dominica. It was a long, 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 long story, you know, but I you know, cut it short, you know. Yeah. We, we arrived in a private jet yeah. at Dominica, you see me? At Dominica. But when we reach, we, we, we don't go inside the airport. Immigration meet us outside. And okay. when, as we come off and reach from the plane. Yeah, them come from the base. Okay. And we come off of the plane step, they meet with, so if we give them the documents and them say, then give it back, so we must turn back and go back on the plane. You see me? Mm -hmm. So we say, where, where we must go? They said, no, no, we must just go back on the plane. We must go back to Antigua. But we didn't have a ticket. We didn't have a ticket to leave um, Antigua. We have a ticket to leave Dominica the next morning, because the same night at the show, a couple of hours from, from the land, I, I did the show. You see okay. me? Yeah, so. So the show was set for a few hours um, yeah. after you landed, yeah. and it was night. Yeah. And you were turned back by immigration people at the yeah. airport, so you must go not, back not to it. On the base, they will never go inside the airport. Yes, outside on the, yeah. on the tarmac. Uh, or so we tell them, say, I want to see a lawyer or something. They say, no, isn't it? And, but the, the, the pilot, 
We want to turn back in them, but the pilot said he can't move because he don't have any paperwork or anything, you know. He just get order to leave us there, you know, them way really. there. Okay. So we could so just go back as you. we like. We would go back in, but we can't just go back as we like. You so you me? were you were you were detained? Yeah, them lock way up and thing. Uh, but we just tell them, say, we're not gonna perform, just bring you back to the hotel. Just bring you to the hotel room, mm -hmm. we sleep and in the morning we leave, you know, but they perform. And but, the explanation given was that they, they didn't want you in the country, right? Yeah. And what is the result of all of so this? So the people them know they, it's like them them lock down the airport because a lot of people come to to, to, to see me when I forward, you see me? So them lock off the airport and send me the people them. And when I got the station, the people them come and surround the station with be a thing up. You see me? Demonstrating, Demonstrate. wanting you to come them out. to release you. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so you have big fan base in Dominica. Yeah, man, we will help them, man. But we there was a demonstration against your coming previously. Uh, from, from Christian groups, I'm told, that there was a demonstration. The reason why you were sent back was there was a demonstration to not have you in Dominica. Um, yeah. So there was a counter. Your people, your fans countered that demonstration, you're saying. Yeah, man. And so where is it now? Where is all of that now? It ended that you have to, you didn't actually perform in Dominica. Yeah, and a lot of things, and you me, some of us pull out a lawsuit on them, is it? Okay, so there's a lawsuit pending. Yeah, man. All right. So, and so when so so that is in progress. Yeah, man. So you suing progress. the government of Dominica? My, you know, I really say government. Can everybody with what happened? You know, mm -hmm. some people innocent of what happened. You know, but me I sue whoever black way. You understand? Okay. Whoever whoever send me back for no reason. Cause we don't do anything. I have a thing named carry come. You understand? Mm -hmm. We lawyer, teacher, artist, certain type of people want to work. You're supposed to go work and find back here, you know, them way there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and in every way, I feel like I'm just bridging rights, you know. Then I feel like I'm not a human being, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. So you believe that they have breached the CARICOM agreement yeah, for man. free movement of labor yeah. in CARICOM? Yeah, that you, and your rights were, were breached, you think? That yeah, night. And therefore you're seeking... Um, redress in court. Yeah, All right, we're gonna take a break right here, Tommy Lee. When we come back, we're gonna drop a brand new video for you. We're gonna, we're gonna introduce the new Tommy Lee. Can you say ready now? So we're going to show our viewers why you say it's already with a brand new video that we're dropping for the first time anywhere in the world right here on stage when we come back. We ride in Ferrari. We drive in Bugatti. We the sexy girl, them we naughty. 